Hey there guys, this one's going to be a real quick one. This one has caught me out a couple of times, but I'm going to show you how to add a Gmail email address to Go High Level. So there's a couple of reasons why you'd want to do this. Um, first of all, if you're doing a bunch of cold email outreach, rather than using Mailgun or an SMTP-based SMTP service, using real mailboxes uh, allows you to warm them up. So you can put them into a warm-up sequence where one mailbox is receiving and sending multiple emails a day and the recipients are marking them out of spam in category folders and then reciprocating that across the networks like LemWarm and all those other service providers. So uh, we want to go to settings and we want to go to integrations and then you would connect Google here but this actually doesn't give you access access to the email address, right? So, um, what you actually need to do is click on SMTP and Mailgun services. And you can see here I've got a Gmail address. Now, you'd think it would just be as easy as collect, selecting Gmail and typing in username and password. It is not. The email is the same, but if I wanted to add... Hey Ryan, it's has got the co. That is not going to be the same. What you need to do is you need to go to the address in question. So log into that email address. So, just log in here. And remember your password. Okay. Click the nine dots, go to your account. Go to security and then down here you've got two-step verification that needs to be switched on all right Look in a phone number so you get a text message. Voila. So you, once you've got two-factor authentication on, you want to go back one step. And now you've got app passwords available. So sign in one more time because 20 times... Then just select other. This would be your own company name or GHL or whatever you call yourself. Generate. So you grab this password, go done, and then back to GHL. And then you stick that password there. And voila, you're done. Select that to default. Otherwise, leave it as is and assign it to whoever's logging in. Now, I hope this helped you. It saves you a lot of time when you're first trying to connect to Gmail. Um, please like this video because it will become recommended and help somebody else and save them a lot of time too. Thanks heaps. Stay frosty.